Hi, America. We have uh, WDTV. What's the director's name there at that one? Um, uh, it used to be Adam Plyler. And he got fired? No. Yeah. He wouldn't call me anymore, YouTube. It's me, Nutty Nuts. You know me. Press subscribe, the bell, and all. Adam, who works for, used to work for the Worthless Dumb TV channel, Fox, it's a shame that you won't cover real good news. What's this arraignment that was so special today that you came here and filmed? Sir, I don't want to be part of this. Uh, what I'm bringing to your attention is, why don't you interview me on the news and broadcast what's going on in the state of West Virginia? Like, for example, yesterday I was down in Kanawha County. I got arrested while I was going to get Judge Thomas A. Bedell's uh, child porn indictment records. They threatened to arrest me for just trying to get it. I was driving there to go get it. The people that punish judges and attorneys in the uncivil state of West Virginia arrested me and gave me a $200,000 bail. But all people that sell drugs, uh, rape people, attempt murders, get right out of jail easy with a $500 bail, $5,000. But the man suing the state of West Virginia is going to be demanding compensatory punitive damages worth 16 to 30 million in compensatory gets a $200,000 bail. And it went from one felony to nine criminal charges because of the corrupt state of West Virginia has arrested me 11 times with 19 criminal charges starting an hour and 47 minutes after the West Virginia Supreme Court scheduling order got to this courthouse. Is that something that should be on national TV, how that the senior bank defenders of WVU Medicine or have arrested me twice. Senator Richard Lindsay, who had the last biggest medical malpractice lawsuit in the state of West Virginia, 5.8 million, has arrested me twice because he doesn't want his fame of going to school for 10 years, the biggest one, and a man with no education getting bigger than three times his with the minimum part. That's just a special and general part of it, 16 million. And I'm going to demand all that. So why don't you guys get something good that uh, WVU Medicine is stealing millions and millions of dollars a month in federal Medicaid fraud. Sir, we have to go live in a few minutes. If you live. want to send any of your requests to us. Yeah, I don't have to send it to nobody. Call, go to wvcourtcorruption.com and read it yourself. Okay. They, a judge on the record openly admits to false imprisoning people. Oh. A man stole a $20 bill in the state of West Virginia and got a life sentence. And she talks about it on the record. Why don't you put something like that out to the American people? Come to my court cases. Film this me. Is our, film this it is all. This our boss who tells us to do this. We're not in charge. We're just doing what we're told to do, sir. I'm sorry. We so why don't you mention this all this to your boss, how I've had 19 criminal charges sir, in a year. You can call as much as you want and tell him. And if he tells us to report <coughs> Is that Adam? Is he still the boss? He's not still the boss. Well, who is the new one? He is actually about to leave. You'll want to ask for Tim, our general manager. Because Adam, he's an ignorant asshole. He said that I needed a, a letter saying that I don't have dementia. Do I look like I'm 80 years old as WVU Medicine? What WVU Medicine does is called political abuse of psychiatry. The Soviet Union in the 1960s diagnosed people with sluggish psychosis and put them in a camp and killed them, the people that wanted their civil rights. The state of West Virginia, Sir, WVU Medicine, is capturing people. Please, so what? I have to go live. You're talking to us. Okay, go live. Oh, that's great. So if you don't mind, um, I have to be able to concentrate and have Well, will you help. bring mine live? I can't bring yours live. We're doing an actual story on something else right now. Like what did, uh, anything that you want to send, you can tell. Um, why don't you go live with, uh, like, sex offending Judge Thomas I'm A. Bedell, sure the other one that raped the two-year-old, the other one that I'm just sorry. got, just resigned, that magistrate there that's been breaking the laws for 23 years. You know, why don't you go live with things like that where all the politics are committing all these like rape said, charges and stuff boss, like that? It is our boss who tells us what to The cover. boss so of Worthless wants, Dumb TV well, goes out and wants people being broadcasted don't for, uh, for uh, maybe stealing a, a piece of a candy bar from the dollar store. They want that on the news. But they don't want all the judges committing felonies, sex crimes on the news. That's a no-no in the state of West Virginia, the uncivil state. Cover it all up is what they try to do here in this sick, despicable state. You need to pull Fox off there and put CNN on there.
Judge James has uh, violated my civil rights, trespassing my rights that I'm born with, saying I can't speak in public no more because I hurt his reputation. His Sir, please leave us alone. We're, this doesn't involve us. I promise you, if you wanted to send anything, I will look at I don't need website. to send it. I'm putting it out there for everybody. Corrupt court? WB Court Corruption. Court Corruption. Dot com. Okay. I will look at that. What is you your name? Impacting our job. I, my, I do not need to disclose my name. Why not? So I can remember who to ask if you check up on exactly. you to see if you and hold your word. That's what I don't want you to do. Is I don't want you to check up on me. So we're going to continue to move on. That means on. you're not going to do your job, right? Or what? Do the word you I just said. I will. So if you want to pack up the camera, um, sir, please leave us alone. Thank you very much. You know, I hate liars. That's what acted in the courthouse and took away three years of my life. Dana Shea cried like a baby to me, wiping his eyes, apologizing two years later because there was never no evidence. And they wouldn't even tell me, what if I shut up and stand back and watch you do your job? How about that? Film you, broadcast this. Would that be distracting you? If I stand behind the camera and film you also to see what's more important than WVU Medicine stealing millions of dollars a month has no medical record to account for an $818,532.80 Medicaid fraud. And they're holding humans hostage in the slave plantation of the state of West Virginia called Sharp Hospital, illegally detaining humans, stealing federal funds. I will stand back, record you also, to find out what's so important here that you have to be here. Somebody stole a farm use truck. Somebody stole a farm use truck, and that's big headline news. You know, oh, something good they were broadcasting in the state of West Virginia was uh, Joe Manchin right down there had a pothole in his yard. They put a senator who goes against the best president in the history of the United States, they put that on the news, a pothole in the crook's... They put the pothole in the crook's yard but they won't put anything good on the news. You know, they don't broadcast how the governor forged the daughter's degree and then goes against our president voting to impeach him. Oh no, we don't want that kind of stuff on the news. We want total bullshit. Good, get out of here. Nobody wants to watch your worthless dumb TV. WBOY, what they broadcast is how many dead animals are from Fairmont to Clarksburg. They do big science studies on the roadkill in the state of West Virginia. <laughs> yeah, they wanted to go live with a person that probably stole a farm use truck, but not all these judges committing all the crimes from sex to civil rights violations and stuff like that. None of that's important to these. They all have education, remember that. It's traumatized, they're indoctrinated. They come from the WVU compound, an element of two substances, stupidity and indoctrination is where those news broadcasters come from. Yeah. All right, YouTube. I'm glad that their job was interrupted. Adam, you little bitch, talking shit to me. Your news is gone tonight because of me. I'm glad I did that one. Payback's a bitch, ain't it? Adam.